Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, you never got Oh, it. hey. How you doing? It's Bill. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Andreas? Oh, thank you. You there? Oh, hey, Bill. What can I do for you? Hey, what? What are you doing there? I just want to see if I got my room moving. Uh, oh. <clears throat> I mean, I try to train my okay, latest well, experiment. <laughs> whatever turns you on, man. Listen, the reason I'm calling is, do you remember our Russian friend that likes to make those homunculus videos? Yeah. yeah we kind of debunked him last time with that video you helped out. Uh-huh. He's back and he's got another video. Okay. I think you're just the guy to recreate that and debunk him one more time. What do you think? Okay. Sounds awesome. Let's do it. Awesome, man. I'm really looking forward to seeing this. Talk to you soon. Well, let's have a look at it. Okay, it moves. Very slowly, actually. I sped it up quite a bit that we can see something. So, he touches it. He moves it and the humuculus doesn't. That's a clue. Now, it moves again. He puts something in the water. The tank disappears. Okay. Why that thing float to his mouth, actually? I mean... Let's switch direction in mid-air. Okay, I have a clue how it's done. First, let's build a hemoglobin again. Because this time it's in a glass. It's much easier, we don't have to put it out of an egg. So, let's form just something. Doesn't have to be that good. Now we take a pencil to make the hole where the tank came out. Yeah, that works. Put in a glass. We need a tongue. Um, just take the pencil. Oh, great. A little tongue. So, oh, stay in there, stay in there. Okay. Looking good, looking good. It's there. Great. Little staging. We're going to mirror the clip as good as possible. Then the lights, and then we pour the water in. That's regular tap water, by the way. Uh, it gets foggy because of the dough. It's flour and oil and salt. It pretty much dissolves in the water. I guess that's the only reason why it's foggy in the original sequence. They already look alike. But let's adjust the lighting and get it in focus. Great, let's shoot some movement-free sequences. Some without tongue. Let's drop something in there. Then I'll send it over to Bubblegum Monsters because they have the proper programs. So, over to Peter from Bubblegum Monsters. I do believe it was originally done. Thanks to Peter from Bubblegum Monsters, was it his page over here? Thanks to Bill for the challenge, was it him over here? Thanks for watching. Give a like if you liked what you saw. Maybe even subscribe, it won't hurt. Uh, and tune in next time. Bye!